I will tell you not the three points three after three, but it's a point nonetheless, and it keeps the unbeaten run going. Does he make it overall? Yeah, it was always going to be a tough game today. Um, we had some good opportunities first half. We, you know, when Jack got played in a couple of times by Jenks, we didn't take them. Um, and we know we know Amber are very good on set pieces, and mm. um, I know they showed that again today. But listen, the boys battled well. Second half, I thought we started right there. We made a couple of changes uh, just to freshen things up, and both subs have come on and made an impact. Mm. And so did Watsy, so did uh, Henry when he came on. But um, yeah, this is, it's a point. Uh, we haven't lost at home since I'm not sure when is it October, something like that. So yeah. you know, I, I, I'm pleased that we didn't uh, finish the, the season at home with a defeat. Yeah, I guess the game like that shows just how tough it can, can be playing against a team of fighting for everything. Yeah. And until we beat um, Flint away, was it two weeks ago? Mm. You now, if we'd lost that game, we'd have been, you know, battling for to stay in the division with the other other teams that are still doing it. But you know, our consistency, you know, our, the points we picked up against Flint and then beating Pont de Pied last week, mm. put us in the position we're in now. And um, you know, to achieve seventh place with two games to go is is a massive credit to the lads and everybody at the football club. Yeah, one of the positive study then, sort of the way the team battled, you know, it was a different type of game for us. Not a game that looked like how we went to look all the time, but that's fair play to Abba, but yeah, we battled hard. Yeah, yeah. Abba fighting for their lives, you know, they, mm. you know, they need all the points they can get for obvious reasons. And um, there's been times this year where that sort of game hasn't gone our way. And um, mm. I thought the boys, you know, they showed a lot of grit and determination. Uh, I think we could have been better in some areas of the game in the second half and managed it better, especially when we don't attend. But uh, this, the, boys, the boys have held on. And uh, got a deserved point. Yeah, but I've set back, you know, conceding late in the first half, but then we've come back out second half really well, and it was a very nice goal on the end, to be fair. Um, yeah. Two subs, you know, subs combined, and then Jack being involved, yeah. finishing it off. No, it was a great goal. You know, there was, there, was, there was a number of passes leading up to the goal, and a good bit of movement and, and play, and, uh, you know, Jack's finish was excellent, so it was a really good finish. You know, pleasing for Jack to come on and get a goal, and uh, and it's nice for Harry to get some minutes as well. He hasn't a lot of time recently, but. Um, you know, he never lets us down when he comes on. You know, he's, he's, a, he's a young lad who's got uh, a big future ahead of him. Yeah, that's, I was going to say about Harry. You know, he, joined, he came off the bench as well, and you know, it's a tough game for him to come on to with the physicality, etc., and everything going on. But he, he's stood out and did very well. Yeah, Harry's learning every week. You can see, you know, he's making improvements to his game, whether that's in training or when he plays for the 19s, and especially when he plays for comes on for us in the first team. Mm -hmm. And he's had an excellent season, and um, you know, people should be should be. Uh, Really looking forward to what the future has for Harry. Yeah, a shame really just not to get that win, just because of how you know it's been great year with the fans this season and the momentum's been building. But I guess it's a, it's it's not a defeat, and there's plenty of momentum still heading to next season and the rest of the season. <laughs> Definitely, so we've got that's what we talked about before the game. Momentum's key, um, and if if you're staying in games, picking up three points and, and getting the odd draw, then you know holds you in good stead moving forward. And um, yeah, it's, it's always nice winning games of football because. Uh, you look forward to the next game then when, when you pick up a run of defeats then the next game becomes a bit more stressful for everybody but um oh, the boys have been fantastic recently one game to go then and in the regular season with Airbus now um obviously a team are relegated but it's a good chance for us to keep you know we don't want to lose momentum now going to the playoffs and no certainly not. certainly not we, you know we'll be taking that game extremely serious um that, that'll you know start our preparations for the for the playoffs against either either met or Penavon, i would think it looks like mm -hmm. so um no, we look forward to that and, um, and then we look forward to the playoffs two weeks later. Yeah, just quickly on that playoffs, and it's a great achievement, you know, it's one which perhaps didn't always look possible at large parts of the season, but the run the lads have been on at a critical moment was really deserved now. Yeah, they, the they've shown a lot of character to, um, to finish seventh. Obviously, we, our aim at the start of the season was to get in the top six. We didn't achieve that, you know, that, and that was down to us, not anybody else is doing. Um, but as the season progressed, the boys have got more and more confident and we've got more people back fit, which, is, which has been a big big reason in our success uh, for the last uh, last nine games and you know long may that continue